Today's video is on the Uaru cichlid, and uh, these are exquisite fish, and uh, a, a friend of mine on Facebook sent me some awesome videos, and I figured I would just do a video on taking care of them. They're a super common tank mate for Oscar fish, and they get about eight inches in length, and awesome fish. Uraru cichlid. I know it said like five different ways. Uaru cichlid is how uh, I actually messaged some people and I've come to a consensus. Uraru, Uraru, Uraru cichlid. That's how I'm going to say it. I just said it like four different times. Um, here in the predator tank, guys, I've been having some issues with aggression. The red devil, I don't know what his deal is, but he's been getting crazy. And... Uh, so I had to change things up. I added a bunch of new decor and I also added all my Midas and another Texas cichlid to the tank. So it's, um, I'm gonna have to up the water change schedule because there's a lot more fish in here, but uh, it's complete chaos. All the Midas don't know what to do. Oh, and I added another red devil. So there's two red devils in this tank. Uh, this this tank is complete chaos. They're stirring stirring up the substrate. It's it's pretty crazy right now um, You can see the water is really hazy. The fish are just kind of getting um, Getting used to it, but yeah the Uaru cichlid. Let's get into taking care of these fish All right guys, so here's the tank uh, you can see these are being kept with an Oscar fish It's super common for the Uaru to be kept with Oscar fish and even such fish as like tetras, angelfish, guppies, people claim that these fish, uh, the Uraru doesn't, they don't chase other fish. It's so weird for me to see a omnivore, such a size cichlid, not chasing other fish. It's just so crazy to me. And people actually say that they, they prefer the herbivore side of food. So make sure you get that type of food and maybe just uh, displace a little bit of protein in there so that uh, I've also heard that they grow crazy fast the guy that sent me these videos um, shout out to you um, he said that th they grew twice as fast as his, as his Oscar fish which is insane really and these guys grow all the way up to 10 inches long so you're gonna want to keep them in a decent sized tank I would say a 75 gallon minimum as you can see the coloration is black green, tan, white. Um, they are nicknamed the poor man's discus. I'm not really sure if I can see this side of it. They have the same body shape as a discus, but um, this is not a discus because discus are super vibrant and such, but these are still awesome fish. Uh, I would definitely get some. I'm actually looking into it right now where I can get some online shipped to me because I live in the middle of nowhere. But um, I mean, uh, there, it's also claimed that these fish have so much personality. A lot of people in Oscar Fish Keepers even say that uh, they have more personality than Oscar Fish. And they're nicknamed the Water Dogs. So, uh, I mean, these got to be cool fish to keep. Just make sure you have a big enough tank, uh, have the right food. Like I said, have some of that herbivore side of it and make sure you have clean water. Um, if you guys are looking for like filtration and such, I would advise... Um, just go with a canister. Um, I would honestly go with the Penplax uh, 700. It was it was 2017 and 2016. Most it was like canister of the year, and it's like a top seller on Amazon. It I mean, these things are top sellers for a reason. Uh, what else is there, guys? Uh, I mean, the the video speaks for itself. These are amazing looking fish. Um, I'll throw links in the description box to some foods you could purchase for getting these and uh, I also noticed when searching for them I uh, a lot of people ask me where to buy online fish and where I buy them from right now I'm mainly buying most of my cichlids from Imperial Tropicals because they do uh, they have exquisite fish they have a crazy cool YouTube channel and uh, they have free shipping anything over $50 and it's two-day shipping I believe so uh, that um, I should make a video on that actually in itself where I buy my fish online right now. So, um, awesome fish, by the way, guys, I'll throw links in the description box to all the stuff I mentioned. If you are in question, you can ask questions. This is my Q and a channel, the you are, cichlid. I know, um, people say this different ways. I've heard DIY Joey say it like, uh, four different ways too. So, 
maybe you guys can help me on how you would pronounce it. Yuwaru cichlid is how I would say it. Also known as the tri triangle cichlid. I know a lot of people mix these up with chocolate cichlids. And there's even some online guides that uh, say these are also referenced as chocolate cichlids. But that's not completely true. So... All right, guys, I am done babbling for the night. I'm going to do some water changes. Hit me up in the comments. All right.